Hey guys, it's G, welcome back to another vlog. Now today I'm actually going to be going to Ikea because I am in need, need for some storage for my bedroom, like under my bed. My wardrobes are an absolute mess and I wanted to buy some like boxes or some kind of like nice, hopefully black. Basically, just some storage for my wardrobes and obviously under my bed and see what I can get. I probably will also get some more plants because, I mean, hello, hello, hello. I think I have quite a lot of plants. But I just thought I would give you a little OOTD, an outfit of the day. Now, I was hoping to be wearing something quite autumnal because it's like the middle of September. Apparently, Mother Nature said, hello, no, I'm here for summer. So, it's like of what 20 degrees outside which is like this kind of weather is my worst weather because i hate summer i hate the sun I, well i can't cope with the sun but i don't like the heat anyway so yeah i was hoping to be wearing some kind of like you know big fluffy jacket some like boots and like jeans and a high neck top apparently not so we're here today and i'm wearing this black bodycon um it's beautiful it's, like, it's literally like my favorite thing ever i never used to wear it when i had long hair because i just thought it looked too like i don't know my hair was covering me i just looked like a big fat slug um so i think i look a bit better now we've got shorter hair so as you can see it's this black bodycon um dress it's so beautiful like it literally fits me so well i love it and then it's actually like um, a jersey material so it's super super comfy and then Last things are my shoes. Oh my god. I feel like I've not really, well, I've actually not worn these in a video yet, but these are my new babies and they basically are um, Gucci. Ooh. But yeah, I'm actually wearing my Gucci shoes. My Gucci shoes, Gucci gang. I'm so in love with my new trainers. I feel like I don't like showing things off like that. I'm not that kind of person, but yeah, I just thought I'd show you what, what I'm wearing. Um, but yeah, I'm actually going with my mum and my nana, so how cool is that? We are going to be going as a little girl gang to Ikea. Let's do this. Face masks. Got mine. Let's go. So we've actually not got the wheelchair van because we've sold it. So the only way we can get to IKEA is by walking. Luckily IKEA is only well it's two minutes away by a car, but walking it's about fifteen to twenty minutes, which isn't bad. You just go down a really long path and you're literally there. Um but mum is here with her glorious granny bag. Which I love, like I think that's great. It's cute. It is, isn't it? It's well cute. And inside I've got my big Primark bag. Oh. So I've come prepared. You have? What? What? What's the matter? I've only just realised. Mum's only just realised we're here, which is just mind-blowing. I've walked by here a few times. It's only... Did you not know? See, you... Deadly serious you didn't know Ikea was here at the end of that road. I told you. And we're there. Hello. You better stop for me or we're gonna ram my granny bag into your wheels. <laughs> no. Oh my god, thank you so Yes! Put your dog. Rue would actually be straight in there. 
So nice, that. Yeah. Oh my god, yeah, yeah. A steamy. Imagine if you had like little doll toys. Oh, if yeah. I was younger, I'd be buying them. Oh, like we needed that. She does. She loves dinosaurs. She's a top boy. It's a fun. <laughs> it's beautiful. from Ikea and it was so nice to be able to see my nana and even go out with her because we've not been able to do that due to Covid but it was so fun we were, in the, we were in there for a few hours and we left at about half one um, and then we came back to obviously mine um, and we had a cup of tea in the garden which was lovely and had a bit of a catch up and then I've literally just come back from picking up my brother from school it's just been a bit of a mad rush um, but but I will admit Ikea has been a very successful shopping trip. I actually spent £72 in Ikea, which I've not done in... I mean, like, I feel like I've not spent that much in Ikea for months. Like, oh, God, that's, like, a good shop. So I've bought quite a few bits to help organise my room. And these things aren't really for, like, decoration purposes. It's just to help me and, you know, storage-wise, I need it. So, but, yeah, since I'm home now and I'm not going out for the rest of the evening, I thought, why not show you guys what I got from Ikea. All right, so the first thing that I got was... This black tinted glass vase. Now I've seen so many of these and I love the look of them. I've seen a lot of them on H&M and I really, really wanted one myself. I did want like a brownie one um, for autumn, but I did pick up this black one. It does slightly look a little bit more greeny black, more than like a cool tone black. So I don't know where I'm going to put it because I think against black, it can look really green. But on camera, it doesn't look that bad. And I'm, what I'm thinking with this is to buy some bunny tails. Now I've been dying to get my hands on some some kind of bunny tails whether that's like the normal natural colored ones or to get some black ones but yeah that is what i'm going to do with this vase i'm going to pop some bunny tails in it because i think that is very like autumnal i nearly bought the palm leaves but it's very summery and i feel like now we're getting into well it's september we're going to be getting into autumn and winter i feel like it's time to upgrade my room into being more autumnal so i'm going to do Try and like spruce up my room, maybe like for a video, trying to make my room a bit more autumnal, maybe add a bit more like, I don't know, autumn colours in it. I got some of the iconic hanging plants from Ikea. Now, I have a bit of an obsession with the hanging plants. One for the back of my toilet, which sounds really weird, but my toilet is like built in, so it's got like, it's kind of built into the wall, if that makes any sense. It's got like a really nice panel at the back, so my toilet doesn't really look like a proper toilet. It looks quite flush and quite modern. It's really nice, so the basically the back of it, you can put decorative like items on there so basically I bought one for the back of my toilet this needs to go back because it makes sounds of an airplane I feel like I'm living at Gatwick airport when this fridge is on I literally bought it two days ago we let it stand for like 24 hours literally did everything we meant to do and it was making the weirdest sounds it's not the best for me when I'm filming because you'd hear it right now so I'm now gonna have to find another bloody black fridge which is so annoying because this black fridge was perfect yeah two little hanging plants love that thank you so then we have these with a little black a bit like that like a little black um storage basket 
However, it's got dividers, um, yeah, dividers and then some connectors, and you basically can panel it off. I don't know if you can tell from like the diagram, but you can have like a section on the side. You can split it into like three different sections. Then I also got another plant. <laughs> surprise, surprise. Now, my mum found these because I was going on about the bunny tails, but this is similar. This isn't bunny tails, but I really liked the look of these. Now, they are basically like really long, obviously fake, but it's like a long weed. I guess they look like weeds, but they've got like really pretty little white fluffy heads on them, which I absolutely love. Then the final thing that I picked up from Ikea were these like grey storage boxes for under my bed. The ones that I've got at the minute are absolutely vile. They are falling to pieces and the tops of them just fall off. But yeah, that is actually everything I bought from Ikea, £72 later. I am pretty happy with what I got and I've got everything I need to start organising my wardrobes and, you know, just organising my life out a bit more. So if you do want to see an organisation video like a declutter, please let me know because if you guys want to see that, I definitely can film it. But if you don't, just again let me know but yeah that is everything for today's vlog i do hope you enjoyed the haul and i hope you enjoyed just seeing what's new in ikea and new things i feel like ikea is actually one of them things where you make the most of the time there i just love ikea i love looking at all the rooms and just the designs interior design is actually one of my favorite like i don't know my favorite things in general like I love home bits I designed my whole room like this is all me like the gray the black and it's like my room now is what it's like the best it's ever been if you want a room tour I'll definitely give you one because I feel like I've not really shown you guys my full bedroom since it has been done with the dark black and the gray like it was still kind of gold but now I've completely converted it to gray and black and I absolutely love it so if you want to see like an updated bedroom tour like a apartment tour let me know because I definitely have got some new pieces in my room now um yeah let me know I'd love to do that for you I feel like I really want to do a video about homeware like maybe bougie on a budget homeware pieces how to make your room look bougie on a budget you know what I mean so if you want to see more like homeware vids just thrown in once in a while let me know because I would love to do that because interior design and decorating is like one of my weaknesses but yeah that is it for today's vlog i do hope you enjoyed um, and i'll see you guys in the next one Mwah.